Hey guys, I'm back. I actually wanted to come on really quickly um, because somebody the other day asked me to do an updated uh, review on two of these products that I mentioned because their ingredients have changed slightly. And those two products are the new Camille Rose, uh, or it's not new, but it's a new version of the Camille Rose Curl Aid Moisture Butter. And this is what it looks like. You guys know what it looks like. And also the She Scented uh, Avocado Conditioner. And this is what it looks like. Can y'all see that? Okay, cool. So basically starting off, this is the uh, Camille Rose Moisture Butter. This is what it looks like. And this is a new container I finished because I bought two of these new ones. Um, so I finished one off. And this is, you know, basically the same texture as the older version or the version that I reviewed originally um, very creamy very buttery I'd say that it feels a little bit more buttery than it did before I wish it had the same slip that it had before that's the one thing that I really saw the difference in um, the smell again I mentioned this in my uh, haul video when I got this stuff the smell is slightly muted um, I think in my other jar, I couldn't smell it at all versus in this one. I smell that cake battery smell a little bit more. It's still like really light compared to my original versions. Um, but overall, I use this the same way. I use it as leave-in after I wash my hair. Um, goes on my hair really smoothly. Super, super, super duper moisturizing. Um, and that is what keeps me in love with this stuff. It's super moisturizing. Um, it's really thick and emollient and it just keeps my hair really, really nice. Um, it goes well with the majority of my gels. I have no problem with it. So for this newer version of the Camille Rose Moisture Butter, it gets a pass from me. Um, still works on my hair. So that's this. Um, for the She Scented Avocado Conditioner, um, the smell, the smell is the same. I want to say the consistency is slightly, and I mean by the littlest of margins, is a little bit looser um, than the original version. But this is what it looks like. So you keep, it's not really running down my hand too much. I mean, if I leave it here enough, it's moving really, really slowly. But um, it's still like really creamy and just really, really has really fantastic slip to it. Um, I pull this out when my hair is two weeks old and I know detangling is going to be a beast. This is one of the conditioners I um, just pick because I get through those tangles with no problem. I can finger tangle, e detangle easily with this, um, no problem, and I don't really see that much of a difference. I know with this one for the ingredient list, um, I think only like one thing changed, one or two things changed. Um, but overall, it still works very, very well for me. So the person that um, asked me to update you two or to update you about these two things, they still work for me. Um, I know a lot of people have been more having more issues with the newer version of the Camille Rose Moisture Butter. Uh, but so far, I went through an entire jar of this and it works just the same for me. Um, it is a little bit thicker. It's a, it has a little bit less slip. Um, but overall, besides those two things, it works the same. So, yep, that's it. I just wanted to come in really quickly and uh, tell you guys that. And I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.